Sharks have existed for 420 million years and have survived to mass extinctions. There are around 500 species of sharks alive today. Sharks are found in almost all parts of our oceans. They can live in both warm and cold waters. Sharks come in all sizes. The smallest shark is the dwarf lantern shark, which is only 6 centimeters long. And the biggest one is the whale shark, which can be over 12 meters long. But despite their differences, all sharks have some amazing adaptations that help them survive in the wild. In this video, I'm going to share with you some amazing facts about sharks that I bet you did and know. So make sure to watch until the end because at the end, there will be one fact that will surprise you so much that if I had known it before, I would definitely have subscribed to my channel. Let's get started. Hi, everyone. Welcome and please like this video to motivate me to continue sharing cool stuff with you. Now let's dive into today's topic. Number 10. Sharks have been around for a very long time. In fact, they were swimming in the ocean long before dinosaurs roamed the earth. You see, sharks first appeared in our oceans about 420 million years ago. That's a staggering 100 million years before the first dinosaurs evolved. Fossils of these ancient sharks show that they looked quite different from sharks we know today. For example, they had more bony plates in their skeleton and a more pointed nose. Despite their different appearance, these ancient sharks were still very similar to modern sharks in one important way. They had jaws. This adaptation allowed them to eat bigger prey than other animals in the ocean. And it's thought that the evolution of jaws also helped lead to the extinction of some ancient fish species. As sharks began to outcompete them for food, over millions of years, sharks continued to change and evolve. And eventually they became the APEX predators we know today. Number 9. Sharks have excellent vision. Sharks have exceptional eyesight which helps them find food and avoid predators. You see, shark eyes are specially adapted to see well in dim light, murky water, and even at great depths. Their pupils are vertical, allowing them to see a wider field of view than humans. Also, their eyes are much more sensitive to light than ours, meaning they can see clearly in low light conditions. Additionally, some species of sharks can even see polarized light. This allows them to see the outlines of objects that might be hidden below the surface of the water. This adaptation is especially useful when hunting prey or avoiding being eaten by a predator. Overall, shark's keen eyesight is an essential adaptation that helps them survive in their environment. No. 8. Sharks have electroreceptive organs called the ampulla of Lorenzini. These organs are small pores filled with a special type of tissue that can detect weak electrical fields. You see, most living things produce a small electrical current as they move through the water. This includes fish, squid, and other prey animals that sharks like to eat. Sharks use their electroreceptive organs to sense these weak electrical fields, which allows them to find prey even in dark or murky water. The ampulla of Lorenzini are located on the shark's head, particularly around its nose. Each pore contains a gel-filled canal that leads to a sensory cell. When a shark moves its head, the gel sloshes around the canals, bending the sensory cells and sending signals to the brain. The brain then interprets these signals as the location and movement of nearby prey. The sensitivity of these organs is truly remarkable. Sharks can detect electrical fields as weak as one millionth of a volt per meter. This ability makes it easier for them to find food, increasing their chances of survival. No. 7. Sharks have incredible maneuverability. You see, sharks have a flexible spine made up of many small bones called vertebrae. This flexibility allows them to bend their body in many directions, making them incredibly maneuverable in the water. For example, sharks can turn quickly to chase down prey or evade predators. They can also swim forward, backward, and sideways with ease. This maneuverability is also helpful when hunting. Some sharks can even use their pectoral fins to glide through the water like wings, allowing them to silently approach their prey. This adaptation is especially useful for species of sharks that hunt bottom-dwelling prey. In addition to their flexible spine, 
Sharks also have a powerful tail that helps them swim efficiently and maintain balance. The upper part of their tail is longer than the lower part, which gives them the ability to steer while swimming. Overall, the combination of a flexible spine and a powerful tail makes sharks incredibly agile and maneuverable in the water. No. 6. Sharks have a special ability to keep their skin healthy. Shark skin has tiny scales that overlap each other, creating a rough sandpaper-like texture. You see, these scales are made of a protein called denicles, the same material that makes up their teeth. Denicles help protect the shark's body from injury and infection. But they also have another important function. They help reduce drag while swimming. The small, closely spaced scales create a smooth surface that reduces friction with the water. This allows sharks to swim more efficiently and conserve energy while traveling long distances. In addition to their skin's protective and hydrodynamic properties, sharks also have a special ability to keep their skin clean. They do this by rubbing themselves against rocks and other hard surfaces. This helps remove dead skin and parasites, keeping their skin healthy and free of disease. Sharks' unique skin adaptations are essential for their survival, providing protection, reducing drag, and preventing disease. Number 5. Sharks don't need to be in constant motion to breathe. Unlike some fish, sharks don't have gills that force them to keep moving to breathe. Instead, they have special organs called the buccal pump. The buccal pump consists of a series of muscles in the shark's mouth and throat that help force water over their gills. Even when the shark is not moving, this process still occurs, allowing the shark to absorb oxygen from the water. This means that sharks don't have to swim constantly to breathe. They can rest and conserve energy without suffocating. However, this doesn't mean that sharks never move. In fact, many species of sharks still need to swim regularly to pump water over their gills. But compared to other fish, this is a much more flexible system that allows them to rest and recover when needed. No, for sharks can camouflage themselves. While some sharks are brightly colored, others have coloration that helps them blend in with their surroundings. This adaptation is especially useful for sharks that live in areas with a lot of plants and coral reefs. By matching the colors and patterns of their environment, these sharks can sneak up on their prey or avoid being seen by predators. For example, the white tip reef shark has a light gray upper body that helps it blend in with the bright light shining down from above. Its darker lower body helps it blend in with the darker shadows cast by the coral reefs below. This allows the shark to ambush its prey without being detected. Another example is the zebra shark, which lives on the seabed. It has a brown or gray back and a white belly that helps it blend in with the sandy bottom. This allows it to hide from predators or surprise its prey. No. 3. Sharks can replace their teeth multiple times throughout their life. As I mentioned earlier, sharks have rows upon rows of sharp teeth used for biting chunks out of their prey. But sharks don't just have one set of teeth. They actually have several sets, and they can replace them many times throughout their lifetime. You see, sharks lose teeth regularly due to wear or damage. But luckily for them, they have the ability to grow new teeth very quickly. In fact, some species of sharks can grow a new tooth every week. This means that if a shark loses a tooth while eating, it can quickly replace it and continue eating its meal. This adaptation is especially useful for sharks who rely on their teeth to catch and eat prey. Without the ability to replace their teeth, sharks would be at risk of starvation. Number 2. Sharks have a powerful bite force. Sharks' teeth are incredibly sharp and strong, which helps them tear through flesh and bone with ease. You see, the size and strength of a shark's teeth depend on its diet. For example, species of sharks that eat fish tend to have smaller and sharper teeth for cutting through flesh. Meanwhile, sharks that eat larger prey like seals and sea lions have bigger and stronger teeth for crushing bone. The strongest bite force among sharks belongs to the white shark, which can bite with a force of over 4,000 pounds per square inch. That's enough force to slice through a human arm or leg with ease. 
In fact, the white shark ass bite is so strong that it has been estimated that it could theoretically bite a person in half. Luckily, white sharks rarely attack humans and when they do, it's usually accidental. No. One, you can help sharks and make sure you subscribe to my channel. You can help sharks by reducing your use of single-use plastics, which often end up in the ocean and can harm marine life, including sharks. You can also support organizations that are working to protect sharks and their habitats. By understanding the importance of sharks and the threats they face, we can all work together to ensure that these magnificent creatures continue to thrive in our oceans for generations to come. And if you want to continue to learn about cool stuff, make sure to subscribe to my channel. And now please leave a comment with your favorite shark fact. Thanks for watching. See you next time.